Hello everyone, it is Aiko's name and I'm back more Persona 5. Um Well last time um last time we face off against the big asshole. Only to um Well uh, we I mean we did defeat it and everything and we are celebrating but for some reason after we went to sleep we woke up here wearing our prisoner outfit. Yeah, this is very weird. Wait, by the way, Akechi is alive and he turned himself in. Anyway, this is really weird. Class will be dismissed momentarily. What? Class will be dismissed momentarily. Um. I, I guess so we need to go home but weren't we yes it looks like school but it also looks very weird yeah this is the um, what is it called uh, the practice uh, part right oh god even Juku doesn't run. He's not running. Get awesome results to track meets alongside everyone else on the team, and eventually I get a hold of some scholarships for college to make things easier for my mom. What the fuck was that? Hmm? Ah, <gasps> but butterfly! Oh, the butterfly! Quick! All right. Yes. Hold the butterfly. If that never happened, I would have gotten to enjoy my time in high school with Shiho. Wait, was that Anne? Also, what are these things doing here? What the fuck? Ow. What? What did... My sister's been supporting the family. It's unrealistic to demand any more. Ricardo? I'm helping Okumura from the scrub, with my father watching over me. That's not like Haru. What? I'm going home. No. What? What? Wait, is someone... So someone brought me here? I was clearly asleep. Interesting. So someone brought me to that place. Kind of like how we, Igor sometimes summoned me to the bathroom room. Something like that. So that means that the butterfly... I'm guessing the butterfly was... It, it was guiding me to get the hell out of there. New Year. Hmm? Good morning. Uh, morning. Well, well, I'm up now. Um. Ah, don't worry. Oh, I completely forgot about it. Sorry. Sorry about that, seriously. A lot of shit happened.
Yep, I'm already looking forward to it. I'm so happy. I'm sure we'll be fine. <laughs> no worries. Pray to the gods. I'm counting on you. All right then. Yes, sir. I'm coming. Sorry to make what work the hell? The first activity of the new year. Oh, yeah, no worries. That reminds me. Happy New Year. Yes. Oh. Happy New Year. And I hope you'll continue getting along with Futaba and myself. We're especially grateful you're open today. You know how everything on TV for New Year's is the same old, same old. <laughs> I mean, he has a point. Hey, boss, don't you have any plans for this morning? I could cook some up, so long as you serve yourself everything and pay your bill on the way out. Ah, right. <laughs> Can't exactly make plans when you've already got customers. How about you, young you. man? Are you going to the shrine for the new year? That's a wise choice. Happy New Year. That's what you say today, right? Um, you sound familiar. Are you? Wait, is that you, Chat Noir? Or should I call you Andrian from The Miraculous Ladybug? Um, it's nice to meet you, wherever you are. Nice meeting you too. But wait, what are you talking about? Are you still half asleep or something? What? There she is. What bam? <laughs> oh, looking sharp. Oh, looking good. Look absolutely lovely, Futaba Chan. <laughs> I picked it out with my mom. Wait, what? Wait, what did you say? Sorry, I don't want to be late to the shrine. More showing off comes later. Well, time to make like a tree. Um. The year's first shrine visit, eh? What do you think we should do? Well, perhaps we don't need to go this year. We don't have any more wishes that need granting. What the fuck? Um. What's up? Did you have plans for today or something? Uh, I did. I did. I promised to do something. Oh, come on, you should have just said as much then. I'll be fine here, so off you go. Have fun. Thank you, boss. It's pretty cold out there, so don't forget to dress warm so you don't catch a bug. Yes, sir. Hmm. Oh, that is cool. <laughs> oh, I love this. Oh, funny enough, I do have a... A cult like that. Oh my god. <laughs> Maybe I should cosplay as a, a Joker. Hmm. Oh yeah, what the hell is he? Well, I'm off. Hmm. Oh, there she is. Oh, so cute. Senpai. <laughs> oh, she looks adorable with a bow and everything. <laughs> um, do I look weird? No. <laughs> what? I look adorable. Sorry, short notice. I couldn't send you a New Year's card, so here we are. <laughs> well, shall we? Yes. Oh, this is so pretty. <sighs> I wonder why there aren't many people here at all. It's really unexpected. Oh, you're right. I'd almost prefer the usual crowd. Yeah, and the end of the year was just a few hours ago. Mm -hmm. Believe it or don't. Only oh, there they are. Sixty-four <laughs> days until the next one. <laughs> Would you look at that? I know I'm gonna That's use the my wrong boys. year for a while. Well, I have an idea. New Year's party tonight to help switch gears? <laughs> huh? 
Didn't expect you two here. <laughs> yep. How many coincidences can there be in one day? But you know, this is kind of a dick move, you know. You could have guys told me, you know, that you guys can were going to come to the temple. Dick move, guys. Dick move. And a good morn unto you all. I haven't seen you in absolute ages. <laughs> we were hanging out just yesterday. Oh, I guess we all had plans to drop by here first thing today, huh? That would explain what led us to the shrine, but to this spot at the exact same time? Talk about incredible happenstance. Indeed, but due to this fortuitous turn of fate, I am able to witness this mesmerizing sight. Truly, I know, right? the embodiment of Japanese hmm. beauty. I think I like Karo better. Senpai? Just ignore him. It's like a fit he gets into sometimes. So, and I usually don't like pink, this? but Karo looks it, adorable on it. To eat together. I'm sorry, I'll be heading out with my family once we're finished here. I have somewhere to be as well. Me too. I'll be dining with my father somewhere. Um, what? I'm gonna hit up some New Year sales with my mom. Wait, what? Well, looks like you're Seriously. busy. And maybe I should hit up the track team and see what they're up to. What? Oh, I'll get in touch with Shiho and find out if she has any plans yet. I. What? Well, I guess we'll all just go do our own thing then. Mm hmm. See you later. None of this. Harold's father? It looks and... like it's just us now. Oh, I was wondering earlier, what did you wish for at the Shrine Senpai? Hmm? Uh, I want to say this is so bad, but. Uh, to stay healthy. Now there's a classic wish, but I think it it's is. a wonderful choice. What was your wish, Kazumi? Me? Well... Oh, I'm hmm? sorry. God oh, damn it. It's from my dad. Uh... What is it? He's telling me that some relatives have come over to the house, so I have to go home and spend some time with them. He decided to come all the way out to the station to get me. My family's kind of serious about their get-togethers. Hmm. We'll hang out soon, so don't worry. I'm really sorry. I was don't worry about it. Enjoy you yourself. Everything. At least allow me Damn, to accompany you to the really station. Really weird. What the hell's going on with everyone? Both Harus and Futaba's Dad. parents is dead. You should hold on to your sleeve. That is your dress kimono, after all. Oh, he's reading. He's wearing the glasses. Who do we have here? I believe this is our first time meeting. This is my senpai. The one I hey told there. you about before. My senpai who's done so much for me. Oh, so you're her senpai. My daughter talks about you all the time. D Aww. Not, not all the time. <laughs> is that hey, not so? Hey, right. I was told you picked these out for me, too. I know it's pretty late for it, but thank you all the same. It looks good on you. Dad wears them all the time, even at work. <laughs> I'm quite the fan of them. Well, shall we get going? Wait, what? What? Hmm? Something wrong? Uh, no. Nothing. Well then, Senpai, please excuse us. Uh, sure, go, go ahead. What was that? Hmm. I guess we're heading back, but... Still, what the fuck is going on? It's really so hot, especially looking like this, but... Bring my mind out of uh, out of the horny gel, but what the hell is going on? None of this makes sense. D -d 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 she was in Taba's mom? Haru's father? Uh, what 
the hell is going on here? None of it makes sense. Hmm? Seriously? Is this thing going nuts? God damn it, Ruchi. Ah. Uh. Oh, look. All of you look adorable. I still prefer Haru. She just looks even more adorable. I could... I kinda wish I wanna try it. I don't really wanna try it. Uh, this one is a kimono, right? Hmm. I, I mean, like, maybe it is a kimono. Let's see, you cut this during the festival, summer festival. Hmm. Yeah, it, it has to be a kimono, right? There he goes again. Mm. It is not normal. Everything about it was just completely out of out of place. It didn't make sense. Ryuji was not going back to the track team, as far as I know. Taba's in Haru's parents. I mean, I mean, I suppose Taba's mom and Haru's father. They were both dead, so how they, how they can hang out with them? She was, she moved because the whole shit, whatever, whatever that was happened. And then there's that thing with some I mean, hmm, yeah, something's definitely wrong. Monday, hmm? What? Warm breeze? Someone's presence? Oh god, who is it? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh god. What the fuck? Dude! The only person I can sleep here is a, is a catchy. You're not a catchy. I mean, you're kind of good looking, but you know. What? What's going on here? Huh? What the fuck? I was just sleeping. That's uh, that's not what hey, I mean, bitch. You've been acting kind of weird since yesterday. What's going on? Are you just what? still sleeping? Your lunch is gonna pull a vanishing act if you don't come down soon. Ooh. Oh, you can go on ahead. I'll be down in a sec. Um. What? Wait, what? Uh, These beans are the best! I, They're all perfectly shaped and <gasps> so shiny. Looks like your recipes have reached housewife level quality. You trying to get hitched sometime soon? <laughs> Thanks, but no. Hey, um, come join us. I Try the sweet black beans, they'll change your life! Good morning. Um, good morning. Phoenix lady? Oh, is this your first gag of the new year? I <laughs> trunk on the guess spirit of the so. new year already, huh? Sure, what you say? It'll only blow up in your face. She'll tease you forever until she finally bores herself. You know me too well. God damn it. Yes, that's Work and your kid were so fulfilling for you. Why'd you have to die so suddenly? What the fuck? Yeah, she's not gonna lie, but yet. What's up? Not feeling um, so good? She's no, been like this since yesterday. You shut morning, up, Morning. 
Do you think there's enough Osechi for me to join you? Wait. Wait, wait, hold on. Morgana? What's that a question? Of course I'm me. Uh, Seriously, I... are you alright? My adorable cat. I... Okay, that's enough joking around for now. Go ahead and grab a seat. I bet you're just hungry. Sure, let's go with that. Thank you for the food. I can't remember the last time I actually got to relax and enjoy myself on a New Year's like this. I'm stuffed too. If only I had something to cap off this meal. Like a cup of coffee? Boy, that was a subtle request. Oh, does anyone yeah, sure. want dessert with their coffee? I'll go pick it up. My treat. You want a Mont Blanc, right, Mom? Oh, how kind. Thank you. All right, I shall return. Be and off careful. she goes, I guess. Yeah, this is just weird. Also, I like how uh, Joke is just right in, way in the back, like like a scary cat observing everything. So this is this is way too much of a mind fuck. What's the matter? Um. Okay, please help me. I'm losing my mind. Sorry, we haven't opened for the day yet. My apologies. I merely wish to speak with him for a moment. Why don't you go and get some fresh air with him? I'll stand guard over your dessert for you. You say that now, but when he gets back and his dessert's gone, I'm pretty sure he'll suspect it was an inside job. I can hey, definitely <laughs> see that happening with Mona on guard duty. Hey, come on, guys. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I guess I'll start the coffee. You Catchy. Know, don't you? We have to discuss this. Remember. That's right. Just like you seem to be. Come on. Thank you. I was losing my mind. Um. Yeah, I'm getting the hell out of here. Jesus Christ. Pikachu, please help me. Well then. Let's try to sort through this situation. So, what's happening? What the fuck that is going on? as good a place to begin as any. At the end of last year, I turned myself into the police as the perpetrator of the serial psychotic breakdown incidents. Your yeah. memory of this is still intact, correct? Yeah. Perhaps the most confusing part of my story comes post-detainment. Obviously, I was thoroughly interrogated about my involvement in Shido's case. But for some reason, after questioning, I was suddenly released. No explanation whatsoever. They... That, they let you walk? Yes. I was acquitted of all charges. It's absolutely preposterous. More than that, it should be impossible for them to release a confessing suspect after only a brief interrogation. I mean, that what's is even weird. More unbelievable to me is. Wakaba. That's He's... right. Wakaba Ishiki. I can't believe she's been brought back to life. For the time being, you seem to be the only one who's still in their right frame of mind. I should get to I don't remember, but let's make a deal. Let's say we join forces on this. What will we do? Because I mean, I have no idea exactly how to. Exactly is happening here. I'm fairly certain you wish to find out the same thing, no? I mean, of course I want to find out what the hell is going on. To solve this problem, don't you agree that it'd be safer for us to partner up? Hmm. Have you made up your mind? Okay, what do you need me to do? Well, first I need information. 
Can you tell me what happened after parting ways with me in Shido's palace? Hmm. I see. Though some abnormalities appeared immediately, the most glaring ones arrived after the new year. And all of the phantom thieves, with you as the sole exception, are living in this altered reality without even realizing it. Go ahead. Senpai, hmm? it's Yoshizawa. I'm in Odaiba right now, and, uh... What? What happened? Um, I don't really understand what I'm seeing, but I'm just going to describe it to you. It's that building. It's really faint. But I can see that palace thing that Morgana Senpai mentioned a while ago. What? Senpai, I know this is sudden, but could you come to Odaiba right away? Wait for me there, okay? I understand. I'll see you soon. That was Yoshizawa-san's voice, wasn't it? I believe yep. I heard her say the word palace. Yeah, she spotted one. Despite not being in the metaverse. You're planning to meet up with Yoshizawa-san, right? I'll join you. I mean, you heard me. Guaranteed to find a clue there. Now that we've made ourselves a new deal, you wouldn't turn me down, would you? Of course not. Especially since you were making that gay pose. I think it is clearly a thing. <laughs> mm. Oh shit, I can see it. Senpai. Yeah. And Akechi-san. We just happened to be together when he got your call. First a dead woman returns, and now a palace appears. How intriguing. Akechi-san, you know about palaces? Would it help you grasp the situation if I told you that I have the same powers he has? Really? Does that mean you're also... Allow me to stop you there. I'm not a part of the Phantom Thieves. However, since you've already grasped the concept, it's clear to me that you're a fellow Persona user. Yes, oh. yes. You can tell, Mom. Don't worry. Yes, I can use a Persona as well. I'm not a part of the Phantom Thieves either, though. I just so happened to slip into this palace with him and Morgana Senpai a while ago. But what could be the meaning behind its appearance here? I just happened to be passing by on my way home when I came across it. Since nobody else is making a scene about it, I assume others aren't able to see it. Or they see it, but it doesn't evoke any real reaction in them. I mean, kind of yes, like a... that's exactly it. I mean, Christmas? I asked some people in the area, and none of them seem to care at all about its appearance. Hmm. Huh. Rather than simply hypothesize out here, we may be better off taking immediate action. You mean, we should go into the palace? And Not how? Only has a palace manifested in reality, but this is the only one visible to us. I realize I have no proof, but it's highly likely that this is related to our current incomprehensible situation. Wouldn't it be more efficient to just go inside and see what we can learn? That I is, mean, fair if enough. we have the means to do so. Oh, it's... Wait, I mean... Um... Yes, it's definitely back, but it looks weird. I thought it was gone for good, but it looks like we've regained access to the nav. I have it as well. Is there a hmm. search history? Search history... How do I check? Ah, there's one search in the log, but... What is it? What is it? What? Oh, god damn it. Ugh. The name portion of the entry has been censored somehow. Could this be the doing of the palace's ruler? Does that mean we can't enter the palace? Well, we do have the search history. So it should be possible to infiltrate it anyway. If you're going in, would you be willing to bring me with you? I can't put my finger on it, but something's been bothering me about this place ever since we first entered it. I promise I won't slow you down. What's your call? 
Well, guess we're doing this. We're going in together. All right. Let's do it. Here we go. What the hell? Well, that's an interesting. Oh, look at that. that I'm getting a that outfit. Here. I've noticed just how mysterious this place is. What could this building even be? It depends on what the palace's ruler thinks of the place. We'll likely find that out if we keep pushing forward. <gasps> oh my god, even this... Is that so? Even this portrait looks, uh... Portrait looks different. By the way, um... What's the matter? Well, uh, I'm not sure how to put it. Hmm. Oh, look. A <laughs> true outfit, eh? <laughs> true outfit? Yeah. Oh, you mean this old thing? Yoshizawa-san aside, there's no reason for me to uphold the pretense of a righteous, sincere detective prince. I mean, fair enough. Enough chatting. Let's move out. Now do you know the... Now that the mask is out, no need to pretend. Hmm. Well then, looks like we are doing this. We have to figure out what the hell is going on. But that day, right now, I'm gonna stop right here. So, yeah, run, please. Like the video, subscribe, comment, hit the bell, and I'll see you all on the next video. Bye bye.